everyone, welcome to Singing with Jewels. Happy holidays to everybody. I hope you're enjoying the season. It's such a great time of year to meet with family and friends and to sing some Christmas carols and I'm sure everybody's super busy. I also think it's a really important time of year to make sure that we keep our voices super healthy. Everybody's getting sick. My last video talked about how to sing through when you have a cold, so check that out. But today I'm going to teach you the single best vocal warm up that you can do to keep your voice healthy. So, this warm up is one that I have been teaching for years and years and it's something that Dumbledore taught me many many years ago and when I learned this warm-up originally I was very resistant to learning it because I found it difficult if I found it sort of weird and a little not uncomfortable but just not my it wasn't my favorite but my teacher insisted that I learn this one and she said it is absolutely imperative that you learn this warm-up and she was a hundred percent right this warm-up is absolutely transformative to the voice and um, over the years I've had so many people tell me oh, that warm-up is the best thing I, I depend on it all the time when I'm feeling sick when I'm when I'm tired when I have a very important audition all of those things, you know, it's really vital to have those warm ups, those things that you can depend on, those warm ups that will keep your voice in top shape, that will keep you healthy and keep you in the right vocal space for when you go to sing, that you're there and it's, and it's well produced and it's in the right place and it's nice and warmed up. I'm going to start with showing you just how it's done. It's going to be an experimentation this this exercise. Sometimes people get it like that and other times not so much. I was the not so much group because for me it was difficult. It wasn't something that I was getting right away. But the reason why this warm up is so 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 wonderful is because one it releases tension in your jaw, in your tongue, in your face in general, and it sort of discourages any kind of tension in your neck and your shoulders, which is so important. It's where so many people hold tension. And the second reason why it's so important is because it really forces and mandates that you engage with your breath and that you connect with that breath because you won't be able to produce the sound, you won't be able to do the exercise if you're not engaged with that breath. And so here's how it works. You're going to put your tongue out like this, just resting on your lip. And the air is going to come underneath your tongue and out, it should feel like it's coming out like out of a straw. So the air shouldn't be like a like just a wash everywhere. There's going to be spitting. There's going to be lots of spitting <laughs> and you're going to look weird. So just get used to it. But um, it should feel like a stream of air coming out from underneath your tongue. So it's going to be So just to get started, just trying to look in the mirror and try to actually make that happen. Just trying to make the air come from underneath your tongue. Everything should be nice and loose. And that's how it works. And basically, you can apply that to any warm up that you do. It's really that simple but it just really forces that engagement to your breath and releases the tension. So we're gonna just do one right now. And again, we're always gonna start warming up easy. We never wanna force anything. We never wanna jar our voices. So with this warm up and every warm up, we really wanna start with our top down, bringing that head voice down, nice and healthy, never pushing that chest voice up, right? So we're gonna start off, don't start too high. You know, start where you're comfortable in your voice, but on the higher end of the of, 
of your of your vocal range. So I'm just gonna sit here. just really letting it be and a really easy reminder I've talked about this before a really easy reminder is just moving that head slightly back and forth We just want to let it be, just let it be nice and loose, nice and easy. And this will help mend that break in your voice as well. Bringing down those registers and letting them blend in there together and letting them be is really going to help richen that part of your voice where you're going from your chest to your head and making it nice and strong and sound like one fluid voice. or strain it's a natural thing to want to strain or stress or try to control things as we have that break in there really just letting it be started was I had always done or a and those were familiar to me um, but those also kind of still create tension when you're going you're creating jaw tension there when you're doing your jaw and your tongue is tensed this one really just disallows that from happening those two exercises are still good and they, they have value but they still won't just completely disallow the tension like this one will. This one is just so therapeutic for the voice. It'll feel like a bomb on your voice. So many people have told me and I experience it myself all the time. Every time I do this warm up, it's like, oh, it's like coming home to your voice. It will become your best friend and the thing that you rely on and I promise you if you do this exercise all the time you will start to see your voice strengthening your register strengthening the break in your voice getting less of a thing it will become mended it will start to mend itself you'll start to transition from your chest to your head with far greater ease you can imply this to every you know any warm-up really you could do the one thing we want to do is feel that steady stream of air as we go through this exercise and not try to punch at any point just really feeling that constant engagement that constant connection to that diaphragmatic breath and almost like you'll feel it kind of pushing down uh, as you as you connect to that breath as you go through the phrasing I hope 
hope you found this warm-up exciting and new and you're going to give it a try because I promise you it will work. I have done it with so many dozens and more than dozens of people, myself, other people, Dumbledore recommends it. <laughs> It's just, it's such a great warm up. I hope it helps you on your journey towards finding your strongest voice. Thank you for watching. I also want to say a big thank you to Kimberly Keen for my shirt. How sweet is she? Thank you so much. And I'm loving it. Thank you for watching Singing with Jules. Tune in next week. If you like this video, hit like. If you loved it, hit subscribe or share it with somebody who you think might find it valuable. Have a great weekend and I'll see you soon. Bye.